Hi, good folks. I'm Anand Tioris, Broker Associate for Berkshire Hathaway Home Services, Keating Rubeloff in beautiful Chicago. Uh, today, I want to talk about selling your home twice. The home has to be sold twice. Uh, you're probably thinking, what are you talking about twice? Well, what I'm going to describe here is how the buyer and the seller has to come to terms. Of course, that's the obvious um, number one um, sell point. But the second point is getting through the appraisal. So that's what we're going to be talking about. Buyer and sellers coming to terms and the appraisal, meeting the appraisal contingency. Uh, if you are a buyer, please go to uh, the section of my blog where you can search homes available for sale. Conversely, if you're a seller, uh, contact me. I have a contact form. I'll be happy to, uh, to get some basic information from you and I can produce a professionally done, tailored uh, CMA, which is a competitive market analysis of your uh, single family home or condo. So we'll begin in a moment. Okay, so today's topic, I'd like to talk about got to sell your home twice. The first one I said, fairly obvious. Um, you know, once the, the, the property is on the market, hopefully it's properly uh, marketed and properly priced, um, the buyer will submit an offer. Uh, there'll be some negotiation between both, uh, both the agents, uh, and they'll be coming to terms. But unless the buyer is paying all cash, um, yeah, any financing deal, uh, the lender will require what's called an appraisal contingency. So what does that mean? That basically means that the appraisal must be at or exceed whatever stated as the contract price, whatever the negotiated contract price was. So, um, you know, I want to show you um, in situations where let's say the appraisal does not come in at contract price. What can you do? So basically, what I advise my sellers, if that's the situation, um, uh, thankfully, uh, courtesy of uh, Paul Rowe with Rowe Appraisals, I've got actually a form that's going to be seen here um, as a graphic. I have an appraisal questionnaire, which I have sellers in situations where there is some doubt um, and the lender may nix the deal. I have, uh, in concert working with my seller, I have to fill out this questionnaire and uh, to very as detailed as possible because there could be improvements of the home um, that the appraisal does, uh, appraiser does not know about. And I submit that over to um, the lender team, uh, the appraisal. So um, I hope that kind of explained to you how you have to sell your home twice. Be prepared for that. You're just not done. Sellers, you're not done. And buyers, you're not done just from coming to terms. You've got to make sure that um, it passes the appraisal test. I um, hope you found this video uh, informational. If you have any questions at all, please get a hold of me. Until then, have a good day.